All right, guys, in today's video, we are building the 29 inch jumping girl from Lowe's Halloween 2023. We're gonna go ahead and start out by getting her out of the box. All right, guys, before I get too deep into this video, don't forget to hit like and make sure you subscribe. I'm not really worried about notifications because sometimes I upload way too much and uh, you might get annoyed. So definitely like, subscribe and comment so we can get that algorithm triggered. Yeah. Come on, Leo. What do you say? Let's do it, eh? Let's do it! <laughs> All right, and I already see her just chilling in there. I see her little doll just hanging out, and she is creepy. She's actually really well made. She is pretty cool. Yeah. All right, and here's, she, here's how she comes out of the box. Looks like she's already pretty much put together. We'll probably just have to mess with her outfit a little bit. Looks like she's got to wait back there. But really, again, like she looks pretty well made. Her hair is in good order. So is her doll. All right, so we got everything out of the box. Here's what's in the box. We got an adapter. We've got the instructions, and they also included batteries. That was awful nice of them. Thank you. And so here is just some of the stabilizers. This looks like this is what's going to kind of propel her body up. This, of course, is her mech, very similar to a uh, jumping spider. And then there she is, the girl of the day. And her creepy doll again again like uh very well made i'm trying to to get some really good footage here of just how detailed she really is uh, you know seeing her in the initial lowe's video you'll notice that i said that i did not like her i thought it was really super that she seemed to attack you with the doll but overall i love her audio it totally goes great with what she's doing and uh definitely looks a lot better than the initial lowe's video so let's go ahead and get her built let's build it all right so we have the first instruction here so step one is we're going to connect a to a so a is part of the base to the a stabilizer which is right here this over and we're just going to connect a to a There we go, get a nice click. All right, step two, we're gonna connect B to B. You just wanna press here, Mikey? There you go. And then we're gonna connect B here, go ahead and press. Let me get both sides. All right, steps three and step four, we're gonna be connecting some springs over here, just as you've seen right here, just to hold her up. So I'm gonna take that back and just wanna pull it around until it connects. Good job. All right, we'll do the other one. There you go. And now she is nice and her legs are set up. This is really coming together. It's really awesome. Okay. So step five, we're going to match C to C. It should be connected right up here. So if you go up, but from her, her knees and you just kind of go around, it's going to be just like this. Okay, now we're going to connect D to D. That's going to be basically connecting. Just to show you what we got right now. Right up here is D. This is where we're going to connect her body to. She's getting nice and tall. It's all coming together. It's all coming together. This is it. Get her clothing unraveled here. And her arms. Yeah. She's sitting there looking 
a little mad. <laughs> her arm. Now we're gonna open up her dress. Inside, inside we're gonna find this protecting clothing. We're also gonna find her electronics. That's probably gonna be the hardest part, it seems to be. My God, she's tall. Up on this table. All right, and this is what we have so far. I mean, she looks pretty good, almost like she's complete. We just need to hook up all her wiring. Just wanted to give everybody a glimpse of where we're at after step six. All right, so we have made it to step seven and step eight and step nine. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna just simply connect E to E, F to F, and then we're gonna go ahead and open up her adapter. Go ahead and get that plugged in. All right, so first we're gonna start off with E to E. There you go. Make sure it's lined up. Let me give it a final squeeze, make sure we're good. There you go, got a click. All right, now let's just connect F to F. Right, and you got a nice click so we're good there all right now we're just going to get her adapter plugged in all right now we're at 10 11 and 12. so in this case you're going to find that there's some velcro here underneath these little legs so that's where we're going to attach her dress all the way around it's going to help kind of keep everything hidden all right, so when you're looking in here, you're just looking for, it's pretty cool, it's white, so it's gonna really stand out where it is. So we're gonna just attach her Velcro right here. Go around to each one and just make sure that we match up Velcro with Velcro. You can flip it around on the inside if you really, really want to. Make it go underneath the feet. But we're just gonna do it right on top. And there's our last one right here. Okay, so we got her dress, got her outfit, and there she is. All right, now that she's all built, I just wanna show off her details before we give out her demos. So you see her face, it just looks really great. The, the cracks, they're nice and deep. They're not actually just painted on or anything. They're actually nice and deep. The eyes are a really good touch. You'll see those kind of flickering when we, when we check her out, her demo. See her collared shirt stained gross really looks good and it goes all the way down her dress just kind of like black dirt and just makes her get the appearance of an old cracked up doll that you've had for like years all the way down to her hands her hands are actually pretty well made looks good i was really scared when i saw the initial lowe's video because i thought her hands were squared off but they actually do look really good they do resemble kind of like mannequin hands. They have a good shape. You can actually see a nail in there. The doll, when I first saw her, I really liked her. Um, now that I've kind of got her built, I've got some time to look at it. It is a little cheap, but it is a doll. So at the end of the day, um, really not that bad for something that comes with it. But yeah, let's go ahead and uh, check out her demos. <laughs> this is gonna be fun. <laughs> Right, and here goes our demo of the Lowe's Halloween 2023 Jumping Girl. Would you like to play with us?
Don't forget to subscribe.